Hey everyone, it's me, Rachu, back at you with a collab with Owl Art. We decided to make characters based off fruits. So I booted up the trusty old random generator and the first result it gave me was Cherry. I was pretty excited about this prompt, so I got to work on the initial sketches. Before I go any further talking about my art process and whatnot, I'm going to tell you a bit about her life and personality. She lives in the modern world and is going to college to study modeling. She did a few modeling gigs when she was younger and she really enjoyed it. She's very gentle and has a soft-spoken personality, but she, when she's around close friends she gets really goofy. Also, guys, she needs a name. Let me know what you think the best name for her is in the comment section below. When I think about the shapes that cherries have, I think of round shapes for the fruit and teardrop shapes for the leaves. I tried to incorporate the round fruitiness of a cherry into her hair, giving her a cute bob look. For her clothes, I gave her a long sweater thingy that kind of resembles the leaves of a cherry, kinda. <laughs> uh, and yeah. So going into this drawing, I didn't really know what to do with her hands. So I leaned into her modeling side and gave her a lollipop. <laughs> Maybe she's filming an ad for a lollipop company or helping out her photographer friend with an art project. At any rate, I got to work on sketching and inking her in. I added some more cherry details in these stages, like giving her a little cherry purse and some fruity decorations on her stockings. Now let's talk about the coloring for a sec. I'm not gonna lie, after doing Inktober digitally for the past month, I've I've fallen in love with the coloring process. <laughs> I, I've missed it so much, and as you'll see in my next video, I, I just had to color some of my prompts in. <laughs> I had so much fun mixing up the colors for her. Now I wanted to do a pink and green color scheme, but it didn't really look right, so I opted for one of my favorite color combos to use when I draw. Pink and blue. I don't know if it really emphasizes the cherry aspect of this girl, but it sure is cute in my opinion. <laughs> And yeah, that's pretty much the end of this video. I hope you enjoyed. Be sure to check out Owl Art's video. It'll be linked down below. Also, a big thank you to Owl Art for collabing and being patient with me. <laughs> I really love your prompt idea for this one. Be sure to like and subscribe if you haven't already and comment a name for our cherry girl here. I really hope you enjoyed and I'll see y'all in the next video. Bye.